so this is my china closet. I have my dishes down here and stuff. But I will always have this piece of art up here that my daughter made. It's paper mache. And she was so proud of it. Like, we got all the supplies and stuff. And she didn't know that she was supposed to make this hole in the top. So the teacher gave her points off because there was no hole in the top to where they can hang it up. I mean, look at this thing. It's cute as hell. How are you going to do that to a little kid? Come on. So then we have poor Grace who puts her heart and soul into this tiger paper mache project and then here's Bryce who at nine o'clock at night tells me he has a poetry art book due the next morning so who stays up and writes poems for the next until four o'clock in the morning she actually I was in bed she actually did the poetry book for me copied my handwriting and everything and I didn't get a hundred percent. She got a ninety-seven. And I'm a little upset about that. Mrs. Hoff. Like she didn't I didn't I went to bed. She stayed up for hours and did this poetry book. She went to Walmart, got craft supplies, bound it with string, got hole punchers, construction paper, used like calligraphy stencils on it. She got a ninety-seven percent. Yeah, I'm a little upset that's about that. Mrs. Hoff didn't like me. And that's true.